Now here's something that's come off the table over the last few years, and that is the idea of an owner carrying their contract. We don't even hear that term anymore because interest rates became so low, no one would consider carrying a contract. Well, with interest rates rising, this conversation would be something that we should be having with sellers now again. And that conversation could be as simple as this. Hey, Mr. and Mrs. Seller, I just have a quick question. You guys have a pretty good equity position in your house. And just one thought came to mind. As interest rates are kind of rising for you know typical mortgage rates, have you guys ever considered carrying a contract yourself? In other words, acting as the bank. This is where somebody would offer you a down payment large enough to pay off your, your note that you have now and pay all the fees and everything else that's associated with the closing. But then after that, you'd have an income stream uh, coming to you every month, just like a bank does. And you'd be charging interest just like a bank does. Now, this may be appealing to some buyers who, you know, for whatever reason, maybe have changed jobs, changed careers. You know, a lot of reasons why people can't qualify for traditional financing. Um, this may be appealing and it may open up your buyer pool. It's not, you know, you don't have to do it, but it's something I just want to put out there as another possibility. Now, this is powerful because especially with investment properties where people are exiting an investment property, they may say, you know what, I want to take that capital gain that I would have paid on this investment property and I want to stretch out that capital gain over a period of time. So I'm not taking one big giant hit. I want to take it over the next 10, 15, 20 years. That can be an opportunity. By the way, these mortgage notes don't have to be a 30-year note. They can be amortized for 30 or 20 years, but they can have a call date. The call date could be, hey, you're going to get this paid off in the next two, three, four, five years when these people can then qualify for a traditional mortgage. So you can put a call date on it. So getting creative and thinking outside the box, definitely something we all need to be doing as the professionals in the room and just talking about different possibilities with sellers will let them know that you're the expert and you are creative and people like creativity. Even if they don't take it and they say, no, that's not right for us, they're gonna say, well, at least he's you know, trying something and he's, at least he's you know, having these conversations with us. Guys, I hope this helps you today. Go out there and crush it in the market and check us out over at E-Real Estate Coach if you get a chance. If you're looking for some coaching, we've got an incredible coaching program over there. But have a great day and we hope to see you right back here at eRealEstateCoach.com very soon.